Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Christmas is coming up and even with everything that's going on in the world right now, I still find joy in decorating my apartment for Christmas and doing little Christmas activities. I decorated last year as well. I only decorated my living room this year. Um, next year, I'll probably upgrade and decorate my bedroom. So I didn't go overboard. I didn't do too much, but I did a little bit of something. If y'all are interested in seeing how I decorated my apartment, keep watching. So first, I am starting off with my Christmas tree. My theme this year was red and gold and a little bit of white. So my ornaments are red and gold primarily. I just turned my tree on and now I am placing my ornaments on my tree. I actually really enjoy decorating my Christmas tree. I think it's really fun, but I just make sure that I put my ornaments on my tree evenly so not too many are in one area so now i am done putting the ornaments on my tree my snowflakes that's what i'm going to put on my tree next they're really cute and a really good size so next i have my garland for my tree and i've actually never even put garland on my tree before so I was kind of confused on how to put it on there so it does look kind of weird when I first initially put it on there but eventually I will fix it so y'all I just realized I only bought three snowflakes um y'all can't see them right now y'all see them when I show the Christmas tree later but I only bought three snowflakes and um I'm gonna go back and get more because I don't know what I was thinking but three snowflakes is not enough for this big this good size like Christmas tree um, so I'm probably gonna go back tomorrow and like purchase more snowflakes just to fill it out because they look better than I expected so I'm gonna get more this is my tree skirt it's like furry and white and I really like it because it matches my white pillow that I bought the other day so I think it will look cute but it all comes together my theme is like like I mentioned earlier, like red, gold, and a little bit of white, splash of white. So everything just looks really coordinated. So next I have my white pillow, my Mary pillow that I'm gonna be fixing up on my couch. My brown pillow, I eventually just remove it because it didn't match my decor. And then I have my little blanket here or bro that I'm folding and I'm going to put that on the edge of my couch. I just have my little red throw kind of tossed right there. I might move it, I'm not sure. And I just have like my pillows there. And then I'm going to go ahead and put my wreath up and then change those curtains to red or white. Now I'm placing my wreath behind my couch. So I have this Merry Christmas thing I'm going to put on my wall here. I just removed the picture I already had up there. And then I have this tree that I had from Fall Decor that I'm going to place here as well. I have these cute small little ornaments that I'm going to place on the tree just to make it look more Christmas. Um, so that's what I'm doing right now. So I bought these cute gold trees that I'm going to place on my table here. I also found these cute little presents that I'm going to put at the bottom of the tree. They're really cute. So next, I'm going to be setting up my little countertop area. I have a red placemat here, and I'm placing another red placemat on top, which I end up removing because I didn't like it. And then I put a little centerpiece on the plates. I also have a candle that I'll be placing in the middle just to jazz it up a little bit. Now, I didn't do much for the kitchen area. I just kind of switched out the cloths that were hanging on the stove. Just changed it to like, I think they're poinsettias. I just changed those. Then I put up my red curtains. It was kind of hard, but I got it eventually. I'm just kind of screwing the piece in place.
that was my entire decor for my living room slash kitchen space. I also wanted to add, I forgot to put it in the video, but I do have a diffuser that I use and Throughout the holidays, um, Thanksgiving and Christmas, I'll put like scented oils in there that match the season. So for Thanksgiving, I'll put in like pumpkin spice, um, essential oil, smell like pumpkins in here. And I went to Walmart and found some essential oils for Christmas. And I have that in my diffuser right now in my living room. So it smells like Christmas in there. And that's just something fun I like to do um, for the holidays as well when I decorate. Put different oils in my diffuser to make it smell more like the season. So I'm just showing you guys my diffuser now because I just thought I should since I mentioned it. Um, these are my two essential oils. This one is my Christmas one. And this one is my lavender, which is what I usually use on daily basis. I'm going to plug it in to show you guys just how it looks. I'm just going to drop my oils in. I mean, you can put as much in as you would like just to drop your oils in the water. And once you're finished, put the cap on. And this diffuser actually gives you options for a light along with the mist. And that's what I really like about it. Um, it also changes colors, which is really cool. I'm not sure if you can see the mist coming out, but it just mists out and you can smell it. If y'all like this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys in my next video.